Hello everyone and welcome back to the Military One channel. The B-21 Raider, the Air Force's next stealth bomber will be unveiled to the public for the first time in early December and the launch of the B-21 will take place sometime in the first week of December. Other details of the launch are still being finalized, said Air Force Acquisition Chief Andrew Hunter. This will be the first time the Air Force has launched a new bomber since the B-2 Spirit's November 1988 debut at Air Force Plant 42 in Palmdale, California. The B-2's first flight took place in July 1989. Northrop Grumman's new bomber has so far only been glimpsed in concept art. Its first flight is expected to come sometime in 2023, a few months after launch. Northrop said in a release following Hunter's announcement that the date of the first flight would be set based on ground test results. The first B-21 completed the first series of ground tests at Factory 42. That phase included a load calibration test, intended to verify the bomber's structural integrity by compressing it, among other tests. To date, six B-21 test aircraft have been assembled at Northrop Grumman's Palmdale facility. Prior to the B-21's first flight from Plant 42 to Edwards Air Force Base in California, Northrop Grumman will conduct engine testing and low- and high-speed cab tests. Formal flight tests for the bombers will take place at Edwards. The Air Force had initially hoped, as recently as 2019, that the B-21's first flight would come in December 2021, but the schedule has gradually slipped. Ellsworth Air Force Base in South Dakota will be the B-21's first major operating base, followed by Whiteman Air Force Base in Missouri and Dias Air Force Base in Texas. 